Spring is a few short days away, even though it doesn't feel like it. And that means it is the perfect time to refresh. And the best part of all that spring cleaning is when it comes to your closet. That's why designer Isaac Mizrahi is here to walk us through the signature looks for the season and talk about all things style. Welcome. Hello. I'm so excited to have you here. I'm thrilled to be here. Even though it's cold and it's like spring. I know, I know. Well, it's gonna make it feel even more fabulous when it's springtime, right? Talking yeah. about breast implants, don't get me started on those, please. Why? Because I'm not a fan of a breast implant. Sorry, ladies. I, just I have like them. It. You do? I do. I don't believe it. They're, they're, they're great. Well, congratulations. Well, thank on you. you, darling. <laughs> on you. No one it. knows. No one ever knows. Well, now everybody, well, now knows, everybody knows. I just knows. told them, but exactly. I'm not shy about it. But yeah, but what don't you like about them? I don't know. I feel like, you know, um, there are just too many of them. You know, everybody looks, there's too quantity, many of them. too much quantity. No, and it's like, it's becoming like uh, almost as acceptable as real ones. You know what I mean? And it's becoming like as if there's no distinction between the two. It's like saying. It's like hair color It's like saying, no, you know what it's like saying? It's like saying, do you want like Splenda in your coffee or sugar? You know what I mean? And I think that needs to be a you difference silicone, between silicone, saline, or natural? No, no, no. In other words, like. If you like, if, 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 if someone likes a breast implant more than a real breast, I think that's crazy. I think it's a little crazy. I, I mean, have any real breasts to speak well, up before that. I mean, isn't that beautiful? I think women's bodies are beautiful. They should all deformed. be considered beautiful. All right. Eh. This is a longer conversation. So exactly. the crop jacket, that's another one that I think is gonna be out in the spring, the crop jacket. I don't okay. know how I feel about a crop jacket. I don't mm -hmm. think I have the hips for a crop jacket. Right. It's kind of just like a crop top. I like it a lot. I like it on I, her. I mean, on her. And also, like, I like it if it's layered over things, mm -hmm. especially, right? Um, I just like it because the more you emphasize a high waist, not as a midriff look. I mean, you know, that, you do have to be underweight like that to look good in it. But I'm saying if you emphasize it, in this way as a sort of empire line, it's just flattering. You know, if you were wearing like a big tunic under that, right, that came to your mid hip or something, it'd be, it'd be cute, I promise. Do you think it's hard for women to look at a runway photo like that and then be able to, to conceptualize what to do with it to fit their body? Because you're the expert, so you can look at that and say, okay, that's for the runway model, that's right. for someone who's extremely slim, yeah. but for someone who has maybe a different shape or couldn't wear their midriff to work, yeah. here's what you would do. So how does the average woman know how to, to transform those pieces? I think, you know, it's like, it's a, it's, it's, it's a, it's a bring along, take along situation. Like, there are pictures that a woman looks at on a runway and goes, and she's scared of, and I sort of don't blame her because they're scary, you know? It doesn't seem like fashion designers really care if they alienate people or if they engage women, you know? It seems like they're in it for shock value, do you know? But then there are other really good designers who aren't, and they're kind of like really trying to give a woman something that's relevant in her life. Do you know what I mean? It's like there are those dresses that are crazy that no one really wears except like really crazy fashion people and they're wonderful. I'm not saying they're not wonderful, but they don't really influence anybody. I don't think they do, not anymore anyway, do you know? Um, it's a kind of stylishness that is like apart from the rest of the world and then there's the rest of the world and then there are like designers who actually think about the rest of the world and both are extremely valid and it's so, what I'm trying to say is, there's a long, long way about saying this, but it's like, up to the woman herself to try not to be too scared of things that she sees. I think it's different for a show like this because I don't even consider it really a reality show. To me, it's a competition show. Mm -hmm. And drama is already built in.